What up guys? So, we had a bush day today and didn't film it, but I took some pictures. Now I'm gonna do a track workout. Um, I think I'm gonna do some 150s, repeat 150s. Um, I feel pretty shitty, I'm not gonna lie. Energy levels are low, calories are low, but uh, gotta do it. Gotta get the body fat down. So, um, intervals today, gonna warm up, take you through the workout. Not really much to say, so I'll catch you in a few. So I'm all warmed up. Oh, I'm all warmed up. Got my spikes on. This does two things. Number one, if you're trying to build your calves, a lot of people complain about having shitty calves. My calves get so sore for like a week after wearing spikes and doing sprint training. Number two, if you ever do try any of these workouts, these interval training track and field workouts, make sure you warm up well enough, guys. I have a video link how to warm up properly. Just check back as a couple videos ago and uh, make sure you're always warmed up before you're sprinting pull out. You can easily tear something, hamstring, quad, whatever. 150s, here we go. All right, what up guys? <clears throat> so I'm actually doing the commentary on the night that I ran the workout for once in a blue moon. Um, I did a push workout earlier today and holy Lord, I had like fucking Batman pump it was, I don't know what the hell happened. Um, unfortunately, I didn't film the workout. <laughs> I was going to, and then uh, I was like, you know what? I just want to train. I don't feel like dealing with filming and all that. So uh, I wish I would have, but I'll make it up to you guys. Might film a back and bicep workout tomorrow, and uh, hopefully I'll have another insane pump again. Um, so anyway, to this workout, interval training, um, short and sweet. It was 6 by 150 meters, which is basically just somewhere halfway around the turn. <clears throat> so you run half a turn plus the straightaway. And um, I was going, you know, 85% effort, 85 to 90%. My hamstrings were destroyed from deadlifting on Tuesday still. So, um, you know, just doing the best that I could. Form wasn't pretty, but, uh, yeah, there you go. So, um, honestly, this is a really tough workout. The rest was short. The effort was high. And, um, yeah, so you just start on the turn here, you're hitting some hard sp strides into it, and then, yeah, dude, my form is so funny. I, I, when I ran track and field, I was, like, you know, 25 pounds lighter uh, than I am now and about 10 years younger, so, um, yeah, I'm a, a, f a shell of my former track and field self, but uh, I still love running, and um, I can tell you right now, I can feel that, like, energy-burning furnace happening um, anytime you do interval training, um, your metabolism is heightened for up to 8 to 12 hours, I think, afterwards. And uh, I can definitely tell a difference. you got to be careful that you don't binge eat whenever you do this kind of stuff um, because you will get really, really hungry. Uh, I'm just drinking a ton of water tonight to make sure I don't uh, go eat a tub of ice cream. <laughs> but, um, yeah, that was the workout, 6 by 150 meters. Um, I was taking 2 to 3 minutes rest, which basically was just my walk back. And then... Uh, that was it. So I hope you guys enjoy. Try it out. If you're looking to lose some weight, uh, doing stuff like this two to three times a week, even three to four times a week can really be a big help. So I'll catch you guys in the next one. So there you go, guys. Five by 150s. About 90% effort. Two to three minutes rest. If you need to take a little bit more rest, that's fine. And uh, didn't feel too good. Feel tired. But getting it done. It's always gonna hurt, guys, you know? It's, you're always gonna have those days where you don't wanna do it. And uh, you, just, you just have to not care about the pain, you know? You have to trust that it's gonna be worth it. So. Give it a shot. Hope you guys enjoy. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace. It's crazy sometimes thinking you can own a piece of the world. It's just flowing.